Local sign, baby. Oh, I'm so excited. I waited so long for good weather, boys. Finally, good weather. I wonder what else is good. Hard deck. <laughs> Let's go, baby. We are outside locals right now. Saturday locals. Let's go. Tell me a better combo than me copping everyone on Saturdays. Let's go. Yo, everyone, you're all gonna get clapped up today. I'm playing the best deck in the planet after Pendulum. I want everyone to know beforehand. No one cares. Everyone cares. No one cares. Yeah, and literally everyone cares. Carmen has made a return to the Game Nation. Welcome to Game Nation. Are you ready to lose the trip gaming? Yeah. Dylan, are you gonna beat me today for revenge? Revenge is gonna be so sweet today, baby. I'm winning today. I'm telling you guys, like, I'm going 10 0. I'm not losing a single game. Guys, today's video, we're winning. I'm telling you guys right now. We're winning. We're winning. Ray is asking the whole locals to beat me, but that's a big ass. That's impossible. That's impossible. I'm going to make it a bounty today to beat this guy. <laughs> if you have a win, a match win against Steven, I'll give you a booster pack. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> Bro, that's okay, guys. You're, none of you guys are getting Make booster sure packs. Goes X5, please. No one is getting booster sure packs. No one is getting booster packs. Don't worry. Yes. If you win, I'm getting. If you win your match, you'll get a pack instead of your opponent. No, I don't want. No, I appreciate that, but I don't want to rinse want to walk the store. Away with, like potentially something. I don't want to rinse the store with 50 packs after my next 50 games. <laughs> don't worry. No one's gonna come up to you. Wait, when Steven wins, I have to win the Yeah. No, it's okay. I'll donate it back. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. The loser is for you to give your opponent. You have to give your opponent. <laughs> that would be worse than actually losing. <laughs> you have to give them Guys. Triple X5. Corbin's your first loss. Corbin. I thought you were boys. I know. I'm, joking, I'm joking with you. Okay, let's go, Corbin. You're the best, bro. See that, guys? I'm second. I'm letting Nog fucking finish first. Insane. He has a huge lead here. But guess what? You're not complaining today? Bro, this guy plays... Sit down. One, one day. Just just no, work or something. He He's addicted. <laughs> He's addicted. I have, but I can't really stay today. Why? Um, I got things to do at home. Oh, uh, you got a date? Uh, not yet. Uh, okay, so you... Okay, okay. I, Corbin, you're just trying to make us feel better that we don't have dates today, but you do. So you're trying to make us feel better. I appreciate that. Uh, maybe I'll try and get a date soon. But the only date I need, baby, is with me and Celine. Because Celine is going to drop 17 negates today. I'm not even playing pendulums. Let's go. Yo, you face me round one. If you beat me, you get a pack, not just from a store, but I'll give you my whole deck. You want to know why? Because I'm not losing the whole way, baby. Let's go. All right, let's go. Let's go. I have my balls crossed. What? Local time, baby. Let's go. I ain't losing no packs. Let's go, Ray. Ray's about to donate the whole store of packs to me because we ain't losing. And until we realize that we drove zero hand traps against the PK deck that's going to drop Scythe on our ass and we're going to lose it because of Scythe. Holy shit. But you know what? It's okay because guess what? I ain't, I ain't going to give up. I ain't going to give up. We are playing the best deck, ladies and gents. So it's all good. Let's go. Let's go. I'm excited, baby. Guys, I'm playing in a triple electrum play man. If you think for a second that I'm going to give up, you're mistaken. Let's go. Uh, our deck does lose to Scythe. We are playing our uh, Cybers Eldritch. Uh, insert 20 hand traps with not eight Magician Souls Brave Engine deck. But guess what? It's all good. It's all good. Sadly, we didn't draw any hand traps. Oh, I drew one hand trap. Uh, Imperm, but Imperm did nothing against the Griffin. So I want to get that out of the field and I'm going to try and clear his field here with brave cards. And I just pray that his uh, fog blade will stop him from killing me. Uh, all hope is not lost in Penland. Despite being in Cyprus land at the moment, I still live in Penland and it's a real place. It's called heaven. Let's go. And guess what, guys? Guess what? If you guys want to see me play pendulums, maybe pendulum brave. Let me know in the comments down below because I'm liking this deck at the moment. I try and bait his fog blade by using my magician souls here to draw two. I'm trying to draw some nice hand traps. See chalices. I'm like, fuck. It's fine. I got rid of your two interruptions. I'm I cleared your whole field. I cleared his whole field. Look at this. I cleared his whole field under scythe. All I gotta do is just survive. Literally, just I have to survive. And th that's it. That's our game plan. And on this triple lecture play man, ww.trippgaming.com while supplies last, you get the Elish man and the trip man. Of course, I'm gonna survive. Of course, with the skills that I learned here, of course I'm gonna survive. Let's go. Also, you guys are hear something insane? Absolutely fucking beautiful. 
Truth deck boxes are going to be released in 1.5 months. I've just ordered them. Holy shit. There's going to be a limited supply, only 100, just so I could see if it like works out and you guys like them. Bro, the, the artwork that I've seen from my artists, it is the most beautiful deck box I've ever seen in my life. What's not beautiful, however, is this stupid ass PK deck that, man, uh, this is going to be about a wreck us here. But you know, look, we did our best. We cleared the whole board, but the follow up is too much. We lose game one. Look, I, I literally told him that if I lose, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give him my deck. And I did that on purpose, hoping I'm going to lose because I'm tired of the shit and miss pendulums already. So who knows? Maybe we play pure odd eyes. We want to see some pure odd eyes because I literally bought a pure odd eyes deck that's just sitting in my closet. It's just chilling there. Uh, but it's all good. You want to know why? Because we opened Cyber's Gadget, baby. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. I put back the Dasher, whatever I, or whatever it was. I put back. I think it was Dasher. Uh, get DPE Scythe out. See you later to these bricks. Set. Uh, hand traps. Let's go. Hit him with Scythe. He chalices the Scythe. I'm like, it's all good. Lancia. Ah, nice PK deck. <laughs> Let's go. I uh, Lancia in draw phase because I don't want to deal with uh, Aquamancer uh, if he used it. So I bring everything out. I bring out Wakaro. I'm doing some calculations. And according to my calculations uh this was 200 off uh I, I actually had game no I, I remember what was missing i was missing spells for celine that's what i was missing for game here but that's all good there's always going to be game somehow there's always going to be game somehow and uh here i'm, I'm like you know what <laughs> game is via <laughs> i think i use lancy again <laughs> yeah, did i uh no no i, I ash is aquaman sir yeah that's what i did so here he has like no plays I'm like, yeah, I have multiple interruptions. I have another hand trap. I have DPE. I didn't want to waste my hand traps with nightmaring. Uh, he brings out DPE. I'm like, uh, I don't care. You're, you're at like 500 light points right now. So this DPE means nothing. He pops these. Don't care. Add ga Cyber's Gadget. Uh, I need at the very end because he used that in battle phase. GG <laughs> game three. I didn't even care about the DPE. Like the thing with the DPE is uh, he's at 500. So he, he's not even allowed to use the DPE's effect. Like this is game over. Uh, this deck's insane, guys. I'm telling you guys right now. I really want to do a whole Patreon series just on this deck. I think this deck has potential to be the best deck. But yeah, let me know what you guys want on Patreon. We're doing a whole new thing on Patreon where yearly members get to pick a whole week of lesson plans. That's absurd. They get to literally pick whatever you want. So any new member that signs up for the yearly membership or the tier zero membership, either or, can decide, yo, Triff, I want for this month for you to do a lesson plan on Odd Eyes. So I'll do a whole Patreon video on how to play Odd Eyes. It's just really cool. A really cool thing we're doing really recently so you guys should go, should go check that out but look at this man i'm gonna have to deal with all this shit no hand traps again uh he sets up uh dag uh look at this oh no he couldn't dag that because he was using a link monster so we're gonna deal with uh so we're gonna make max running with the dag though so we're gonna deal with this dpe i'm like damn and then there's like two minutes on the clock activate dp i go so we're gonna get it off the field then i crow i crow his scythe ah i crow his scythe see you later buddy let's go <laughs> and just like that crow is sight there's like a minute left on the clock i'm like bro i'm just gonna take your field and attack for like 5,000. gg access code Ooh, guys that was a crazy match holy shit as you guys are watching it one thing you guys can't see is that time was a factor too uh he my opponent said he was gonna go into break sword break sword i don't know anything about about pks my opponent played very well uh no i did not no you did no you played very well you played very i want to give my opponent kudos he played he played very well there were situations where he couldn't make a mistake interrupting, but he didn't. He was also very aware that Fogblade <coughs> stopped hit, like his and my monster from attacking earlier. Like he got rid of it with the souls. I was hoping souls was going to save me. Or I was hoping souls was not going to leave the field so I could survive one extra turn game one. That was a really fun match, really solid match. You guys see the power now of just random links, just random link too. Like the cybers are actually insane. So we're going to go next round right now uh, with the deck. So far it's going well. Uh, let's go. Our journey to 5-0. YCS Charlotte testing, baby. Not YCS Charlotte testing. YCS Charlotte winning. You guys are watching ahead what's going to happen when I win Charlotte with this deck. Let's go. Yo, you're still playing your sick-ass uh, Winda deck? Ah! With the Necros? It's, it's Necros with Winda, yeah. Ah, let's go. What a great start, bro. 1-0. Time to be 2-0. Let's go. We're facing off against my boy. It's always a pleasure to duel my guy here. He is playing a super sick Necros deck that focuses uh, around some form of lock via winda or via necros unicorn so thanks to the lh stuff we do have a pretty solid matchup here uh so we'll see what he puts up here he does brick because he normals ghost ogre so he doesn't have a normal but that still uh, has access to maximus 
and he's gonna get his, his uh stuff out here I'm, i hand trapped the zap cologne and we're good to go no wind up no problem we also kind of brick here i have to set my scythe and send it with souls scythe is really doing nothing against this deck i drew two with souls triggered scarlet that's a cool play as well uh i teach this on patreon all the time boys shit's insane every time you use souls for scarlet chain scarlet you don't want to draw fucking golden land you don't want to draw golden land it's important to do little plays like that if i drew a wakero there or something was dead i go nightmare cerberus here because i want to bait the maximus i want the maximus out of there and then i just literally set everything i'm like it's all good i was just trying to get that florida elite out of my face uh i'm gonna bring these out and boom shakalaka we're lit let's go let's go he was prop of rights i'm like all right i had to get rid of the maximus asap Clausalus to negate his own secure gardena very cool play bls and again he's playing against Eldritch here bls 4500 attack can be target destroyed Eldritch can't defeat it yo axis code is my only answer to, to this bls right now because i cannot target it i cannot destroy it and, and it's 4500 attack so my golden lord cannot just like i literally just can't beat it the only way to defeat it is axis code talker so i have one more turn because if he kills all my monsters uh thing i won't be able to so i go needle fiber I uh, line up, take his gamma or I line up, take his ghost soaker to make needle fiber to be able to put uh to be able to actually make access code talker here and I'm forced to get rid of this I'm forced to get rid of it. he has two spells in his grave very luckily set up Kunk scarlet gg let's go let's go that's that got their pendulum baby ah I love this deck I love this deck guys yo you guys got this far guys smash the subscribe button smash the like button and what else you gotta do is smash the gym button you fat fucks what the heck I'm sure I'm kidding. I know all my viewers out of every viewer out of every Yugi tuber. My viewers are definitely the most jacked. You guys have your six packs have six packs and your biceps have biceps. Your triceps don't even have triceps. Your triceps have shoulders for triceps. Uh, boulders, not shoulders, which also are your shoulders. Yeah, I just decided to say random words in the English language. But anyways, game three or game two here. Game two. We do not want to get caught with the window. Uh, let's go, bro. Let's go. We can't lose here. We can't lose here. That's my boy. I would like him to get the pack, but I can't let that happen. I'm the bounty. Dog the bounty hunter. Triv Gaming, baby. I ain't losing. Let's go. Let's go. And now we, we're not bounty hunters. We're MILF hunters. Or a little of both. Let's go. We imperm the Gale Dagra. See ya. Go Chris and Lan. This is a great start. Twins. So I can't add. There's nothing else to twin. I think Cosmic's a lot better card this format. Just so you guys are aware. She play Cosmic a lot this format. Because it stops Scythe. Uh, and I mean, who cares? But I don't want to play that lich, but it stops sight, which is very important. <clears throat> Here I'm just calculating what can I get the most value for. I go Verte there. Uh, I sided out Scythe and Dagda because it does nothing against this matchup. Both of them do nothing. Uh, so I showed him my Scarlet. And there's nothing, nothing can do here with the with the DPE. Uh, the Nadir is his only play at the moment. Uh, but I mean, that's fine. I, I, I let that resolve. Away from Maximus. And uh, Maximus can't resolve. He uses floor. I chain Scarlet. See ya. And yeah, that's that's gonna be game, boy. Boys, let's go. Pen best deck. L Cy Cyber's best deck or pen best deck. Damn, that's a tough one. But not really, cause pen best deck. Cyber is second best deck. Let's go. But yeah, guys, I want to show different content, different videos. This will be the last duel of the day. I'm gonna show you guys the rest of the stream here or the last of the rest of the vlog. Uh, we ended up losing one of the games here to time. That's gonna come up soon. Uh, time we need to play faster uh and yeah guys it is overall solid tournament and uh we're gonna use this deck a few more times and after i'm gonna try 10 year sword soul and then uh, another base deck because i want to try every single deck for you guys in different vlogs let's go solid match there against the basis fuck necros deck at the end of the day the elegant engine does help for a lot of stuff like this you get scythe you get wind out you get uh hit with all this unicorn that's what you got elegant for chris Island f we good so that's the beauty of this deck it mixes very well together and it's like what Synchro Elich should have been back in the day, but now just a billion, kajillion times better because I'm playing it, baby. Let's go. So we're going to wait for the next round. I'm hungry, so I'm also going to go get some food. Yo, Alan, Drytron sucks. Yo, this is the goo. It's, you're too all right. We'll see you yeah. in the next round. I beat you. Ah! Ah! He's defending the honor of Drytron. I'm not scared, bro. I'm not scared. I, I, you, you're not playing pen. How are you going to win? You're not playing pen. He's speaking facts, though. You're not playing pen. You can't win. I, I, accept, sick. I accept your challenge, and you are right. <laughs> Let's go. This is a massive battle here. <laughs> Salamander versus Sky Striker, 2022. Yes, sir. Three year back time machine. Who the fuck plays decks from like 2015? What the fuck? <laughs> One thing I'm finding that's very important in this deck is there's a lot of lines for potential misplays, both from you and your opponent. Uh, 
I, I'm playing, I'm thinking like, man, this, I saw a crazy line of play that you would never think about just using charmer plays and baits and starting off with Verte as the interruption and going access code talker, saving one extender, post access code talker, getting into your own access talker to Verte. There's a lot of small plays involved with Nightmare, with going Nightmare Phoenix and Nightmare Cerberus so they can't destroy the, the Cerberus because of Cerberus effect. And then go access code talker and then get destroyed. I know, like we're talking a little fast for all the new players there, but there's a lot of lines of plays and I fucking love it. So I'm super excited for the next round and it's very easy, especially because you have so many small interruptions like hand traps, so you have to know what your opponent is playing inside and out. I didn't know my last opponent, I didn't know his deck very well. So I have to, you have to like very, know, you have to know very, 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 very well what to interrupt, when to interrupt against all the meta. I would not recommend this deck for anyone that is not uh, very, very, very in tune with the entire meta and what to interrupt at what time. Because if you do know though, it's very good. It's fucking amazing. Best deck after Pendulum. Let's go. Next round's about to start. I'm gonna get some food. I fucking love Pedalite. You guys know from the last vlog, I told you guys how much I love this place. I'm gonna get some awesome food. And uh, I'll see you guys inside. Peace. End of the tourney, man. It's fucking pissing me off, man. We. I don't know what to say about the deck. I don't know how the fuck we, we play 25 starters. You're not going to see one starter. Uh, I have a feeling that the deck's probably better without Eldritch. We'll see how it goes over the next few weeks. There's still seven tournaments a week to, put, to test this out. This is our second tournament with it now. But I think the Eldritch engine against mid decks, it's solid. But against decks where you want to like see other hand traps and stuff, I think it could be a solid idea to just remove it. Playing it, 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 it just felt so ass, to be honest. It does offer the meat of the deck, but what else other offers meat to the deck? Hand traps, stuff like that to give a defensive play if you get, if your play gets stopped. So I think it's all right. We'll see how it is. I like the Cypress cards. I think overall the deck's really good, but there's definitely some fine tuning that needs to be done. We have two weeks for Charlotte to fine tune it. Let's go. Oh, so sexy boy. Oh, so cute boy. Hey, you don't need your permanent marker. This sexy boy. You have a permanent uh, marker? Yo, I just took out a damage card, bro. No, no shit. Like, you I signed can, with like, a pen. It? No, yeah, like, you can see it. Yeah, because you signed with a pen. I didn't know. I'm not selling. I don't play. I don't play D &D. Sexy it's boy, okay. not well, so if you smart. If you do, anyways, you're gonna pop everyone up. <laughs> Sex, sexy boy, not so smart. Hmm. <laughs> Let's go. Best deck. I actually abandoned you today and played another trash deck, bro. I love, I love you, Pendulum. That's the only reason I lost. 100. Ah! Yo, chat. If this video gets, let's say, two likes, one thousand, <laughs> one thousand likes. I will do a performer pal deck and I'll build it here performer pals. Yo, we just need plush fire back, baby. Plush fire. Let's go. Yo, the world is over with plush fire. It's yo, never Ray, coming back, you yo. Own, yo, you're the owner of this locals. Let me just play it. No, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> Doesn't work like that. Konami still owns me. <laughs> Konami don't own me. Uh, yeah, I mean, he did for a year. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what you, what, Ray?